that. So point. it's great. Well, we're going to look. We're going to go into everything. You probably saw this morning. I put out a statement. We're going into everything. This isn't going to be a small deal with China. This is either going to be a very big deal, or it's going to be a deal that we'll just postpone for a little while. But we've been dealing with China. We've had a great relationship. I have a great relationship with President Xi. The relationship of my people to uh, Chinese representatives has been very good. They're negotiating now. They'll be coming over here at about 4 o'clock. And uh, we'll be talking to, actually, one of the top leaders in China, as you know. Uh, I think that probably the final deal will be made, if it's made, will be made between myself and President Xi. Uh, but we're certainly talking about theft. We're talking about every aspect of trade with a country. And we're talking about fentanyl, too. Uh, as you know, most of the fentanyl, which is killing 80,000 Americans years, it comes through China. And in China, it was not criminalized. And uh, they've agreed to criminalize fentanyl and give it the maximum penalty. The maximum penalty in China, if you're selling drugs, is death. It's the death penalty. And they've agreed to do the death penalty for selling fentanyl. And if it's shipped to the United States, that would be a very severe penalty. So uh, I think that's going to have a tremendous impact. We put that one item into the trade deal, the fentanyl. I think it's a very important item to put in. Uh, but they've agreed. They've agreed and agreed very readily. We, we really appreciate it to criminalize the sale of fentanyl. Steve? Do you think you'll make, make the March 1 deadline? I don't know. I mean, it's... Uh, I can tell you there's a lot of people who are working. Uh, what happens, uh, we're charging uh, large tariffs to Chinese products that are coming in, which hurts China. Uh, as you know, you saw the reports. Uh, out of the 25 points, we're paying for four points out of the 25. They're paying for 21. That's a big difference. I've always said that. We're taking in billions of dollars, and frankly, we're creating a lot of industry. Uh, but uh, the rate goes from 10 percent to 25 percent on March 1st. So they would like to do it. And I'd like to accommodate them. If we can, I'd like to accommodate China if we could get the deal done. It's a lot of work because this is a very comprehensive deal. This isn't what we're talking about. You know, they're going to buy some corn, and that's going to be it. No, they're going to buy corn. Hopefully, they're going to buy lots of corn and lots of wheat and lots of everything else that we have. But they're also talking heavy technology, heavy manufacturing, financial services, and everything else.